Okay, so, um, I'm so distracted right now. <laughs> I, can't, I can't focus. Okay. Give it up for Ryan Ash. <laughs> What a pleasure to be here. Thank you. That is overwhelming. I moved to Winnipeg from Edmonton um, January 13th of 2010. So I'm past my five year anniversary at this point. <laughs> Bit of a quintuple threat, you know, rapping, singing, because singing is not rapping, and vice versa. I dance. I act, I comedy, and I play with plaster scene. You know, you know, this is not plaster scene. This is that's the real deal, right there. Okay, paid a buck fifty, got a pop on the side. I, I, I'm a little stressed out, and one of the best ways to relieve stress is to get physically active. It's very important. Yeah, you uh, release all these endorphins, and that is our first word of the day: endorphins. Endorphins. This is mini mall. It's kind of like, it's all about uh, the kind of sense of humor that I enjoyed when I was a kid, kind of my age range. I'd say I was around like 10 to 12 and I was really getting into Animaniacs. So it had this kind of combination of off the wall stuff coupled with like real old comedy bits, like some Marx Brothers style bits, like really actually running the art of kind of a gag. So I try to stick to the skeleton of like five different things. And you know, uh, I improv the rest of it through the whole shebang, just doing all the voices and stuff on the fly. Stop, eat a hot dog, you know, get back into it. Another act, five bitlets, rough skeleton, stop. Maybe half a hot dog, yeah, half of an HD. That's a good lesson, kids. Don't drink the mall fountain water. I've actually written a song about it. <clears throat> oh, don't drink the mall fountain water. You know, like lately I've been, uh, I just noticed uh, a guy on steroids at my gym. So I've been kind of running him over and over in my head for <laughs> some time. Talking like what kind of makes a guy do that many steroids. Um, do we got a clip? Let's go to a clip. No, I can't do that, can I? There's a guy at my gym who's on so many steroids, I feel sorry for him. I just want to walk up and be like, hey man, how about today we start with 10 reps of good hugs? <laughs> Followed by a cool down set of me telling you you're fine the way you are. Kind of uh, monkey see, monkey do. It's like, uh, that's what a lot of comedians I admire kind of tie their life into it. Uh, like one of my big influences is named Pete Holmes. Um, and he's a hilarious dude. He's all over the internet and Vine and everything like that. But he talks really, he talks a lot about himself, but he also isn't afraid to go off the wall and kind of be a cartoon character at some points. And that's really like, that's what I try to do too. I think that's what lends itself over to doing the kids show as well. It's like that translates across because I can have that really up energetic side to me. You know, it's just, it's all about maintaining a proper diet and just indulging every now and again in vitamin HD, hot dogs. It's okay to exert it a little bit. Uh, uh, I'm lifting weight. But he's like Arnie stepping out of that airlock in Total Recall. I'm just waiting for like the subtext to leak in one day. He's just gonna be like, uh, uh, Dad! Dad! Well, thank you. Thank you. That was a really good interview. Thank God for me. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> now you can eat your <laughs>